Hi friends, in this video we are going to learn how to enter VAT entries as per uh, Dubai VAT that is UAE United Arab Emirates. Dubai has been uh, introduced VAT from January 1st 2018. First you have to do is uh, update your tally 6.3 older version will not work out after go here create a company how to create a company i will show you company info already i have created i am showing in alter mode here i entered the company name then mailing detail Here enter the country as UAE so that statutory features will available. Here enter the date of box begin from. Here I entered 1118. <coughs> here enter enable VAT yes. Here and number here. Registration date and select the quarterly. Monthly retail return is only for certain people so most of people has to file quarterly that's it now what you have to do is uh, create a ledgers for purchase ledger you have to create a supplier ledger purchase ledger then tax ledger here i am going to explain one by one ledger Alter. You have to select uh, this create ledger. Now I select alter ledger so, to show the demo. So here for purchase voucher supplier supplier ledger. This comes under credit hours. Here you can enter the address of the supplier. Here the country, then state. Registration type. Here I enter a regular registration dated year and number that is uh, VAT registration number that is the 50 digit number. That's all. After that, purchase ledger for purchase entry, you need one supplier ledger, then purchase ledger, then input VAT ledger. So, this is. Purchase ledger under group purchase accounts. Taxability is taxable rate of VAT is 5%. Here, that's it. Then input VAT. This comes under duties and taxes. Ledger duty type is VAT. That's it. Now I am going to show you. For sales voucher, what are the ledgers required? Please note down. One is customer ledger, then another is uh, sales ledger, then third one is output VAT ledger. You please note down this ledger how I have created. So go to customer ledger. Under group Sunday data, here the name will come automatically. Here you can enter. His address, customer address, country, the country of the data. Here, what type you can select regular, whether he is regular or unregistered dealer. What registration dated? They will provide this date. This number also the party has to provide so that you have to enter here. Then sales ledger, oil sales ledger, under group is sales accounts, taxability is taxable, rate of duty is 5%, that's it. Now the third one is uh, output VAT, see input tax ledger will come in purchase and output tax ledger comes in sales voucher. 
under group duties and taxes duty type is VAT that's it now we will go purchase register and sales ledger how I have created just you watch it display account box purchase register in this purchase voucher this company that is testing data is the company name he is purchasing material from supplier one register dealer that is oil he is purchasing the dealer name is this is and oil purchase is here this is the oil he is purchased oil 500 liters at rate of 30 rupees per liter here you have to enter input tax this input tax ledger then purchase ledger and supplier ledger already I have explained the new item is item how to create the item there are so many videos available in YouTube anyway I will show you how to create this stock item oh, yeah. this is why you have to create is you have to maintain stocks how many liters has purchased how many liters has sold and how much is remaining balance for that you have to use this stock item So purchase is over. Now I will show you sales. How I have entered sales. See your company. Say example, your company is testing data testing. Customer one, you are selling goods to customer one, which you are supplying oil. So that oil sales. Here the stock item which you are uh, supplying oil. So 400 you are selling. For this tax you are collecting is 5%. So here then sales ledger oil is the output vat. That's it. Without rate tax, how to enter in without rate that is I am going to explain here. Here I entered a customer customer two we have to choose because he is unregistered, there is no tax for him. Here I selected uh, oil sales at zero rated oil. That's it. Now go to see how much VAT is payable. Go here statutory reports. For go back to main tally, press escape key. This is the gateway of tally. Go to display statement of reports VAT select VAT see this is the sales total sale is 32,000 and 28,000 is taxable at 5% that is 1400 and 4000 is exempted zero rated Overall purchase is 27,000. From this, 21,000 is taxable at 5% and 6,000 is zero rated. Overall tax collected is 1,400 and tax paid is 1,050. Remaining 350 is payable. Balance payable. Now we will show you how to the VAT return. How it will appear here? Click. E returns. Click now. Here I am going to export into Excel file.
set tally here p9 release this is the file name say from 14 to 31st march 1st january to 31st march for 3 months 14 yeah, this is your wet return <coughs> this is overall your company details what number company address everything here the tax due what to do this is the sales turnover taxable and this is the tax this is zero rated there is no tax so total tax is 1400 the purchase or expense 21000 For this, we have collected thousand five hundred. Sorry, paid thousand four paid tax already in purchase. So the difference between thousand four hundred and thousand fifty is three fifty. This is the balance you have to pay. I think you have understand. Thank you for watching this video. Please share our videos, subscribe our videos, like our videos. you can share with your friends through over uh, whatsapp also also you can send feedbacks in comments section <coughs> thank you for watching this video have a nice day bye